Hello everybody, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to get the teapot hat in Pilgrimed. This helmet is pretty drippy and it can summon a teapot from the sky, which can do like 170 damage. The stats aren't the best, and it's almost always better to use the mushroom hats, which is the drop from old farts. We're looking at 10 intellect, minus 10 agility, plus 15 mana, and minus 10% mana cost. You obviously also get the teapot skill. For endgame players, I can't see why you'd use this in a build, but it's really easy to get, so it may be good in the mid game. Let's see how you actually get the helmets. So you want to equip a build with jump heights. If you have the speed demon build, that would be good. Otherwise, you might just want to use the climbing picks. So we're heading towards the mountain, and we're gonna go up to where the warden spawns. I might actually make a video on the warden, because he's a really easy early game boss. And he drops the Executioner's Greatsword, which can be good for the mid game. One thing that I wish that Pilgrim added was more helmets. Especially for melee builds, it seems like there isn't really any good options in the late game. Like, there are a few helmets, but the problem is you can't really use them because they have set bonuses, and the build that you're trying to use does not benefit from the armor piece. That's why I think that adding more helmets like the teapot, which are just standalone helmets, could be good for the game in creating more build diversity. So to get the teapot, you want to drop down this little cliff here, and talk to this NPC, and rip the teapot off his head. And now the teapot is yours and you can equip it. I like how random this interaction is. It really exemplifies the spirit of this game. Okay, that's all for now. I'm going to drop a build video later, so if you want to see that, then subscribe to the channel. Peace out.